Okay everyone, today I'm going to show you how to a custom cursor that I made today. I made this custom cursor and I'm going to move it to the Windows uh, cursor folder. Yeah, I'm going to move it there. I'm going to show you how to do that. First thing you're going to want to do is save your custom cursor to your desktop. And then next thing you're going to click on Windows Start. And then you're going to scroll around until you find control panel. And then you're going to go and click on mouse uh, to bring up the mouse properties. And then you're going to close this window. And then as you can see, you see buttons, pointers, pointer options, wheel, hardware, mouse, and keyboard center. What you're going to do is click on the pointers tab. And then you're going to click on browse. And that brings up the Windows cursor folder. And uh, you can either move this custom cursor with, into with all these other cursors, or you can do something smart like I did and create your um, create a folder um, inside the Windows uh, cursor folder. So I created this folder inside the cursor folder. And I uh, all you do is right click. Uh, scroll down to new and choose folder and give it a name. And I have a cold, sorry. <coughs> okay, now you um, click on your custom folder and you drag this custom made cursor from your desktop to the little box in here. And you get a little warning, just say continue. And there you have it, people. Oh, that ain't it. What is it? Anyway. And there you go, people. I moved my custom cursor here to my custom folder that's inside the Windows cursor thing here. <laughs> that's it. And if you want to use it, this is what you do. Real easy. You find the one that you want to find. Like right here. You find the custom cursor you moved there, and then you click Open and then you click apply and then you click okay and that's how you do it and that's what I did and there you go